and welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm gonna do a kind of big grocery haul. We haven't done a big grocery haul in a while. We've been kind of doing like little Trader Joe's hauls and um, just picking up things here and there as we need it. But this was a pretty big haul. Um, the total came to, it's not focusing, uh, 179.96, but that also included the fee for the um, pickup I did curbside so um, without curbside it would have been 173.61 but that five dollars was well worth the time that I didn't have to spend at the store picking everything up so let's get to it um, first thing right here oh, if you saw on my last grocery haul um, my last HEB grocery haul I usually order the like 120 calorie um, mini ice creams and I thought that or mini drumsticks and um, when I went to pick up they had to substitute me today and like sometimes there's a differentiation between like there's like a caramel one and just like a regular one and I thought that's what she meant when she told me she was substituting but no <laughs> she substituted me for these mini drums and had I known, I would have said no, but whatever. I need to start, you know, eating less anyway, but they're like literally this size right here. Like they're like smaller than my finger. Um, they're kind of like a sick joke, but <laughs> I mean, now that I know going into them, they're gonna be tiny, um, it's fine. But the first time I got them, I was like, what the heck is this? So I did get these, I meant to get the bigger ones but um yeah I mean if I don't know why I'm going on about these but they're they are one cone is 70 calories which to me I would rather have a bigger cone for 120 calories but whatever okay so that's first um, we did get paper towels. We got bounty. This is upside down. I didn't even realize um, In terms of snacks, I got some mini rice cakes H-E-B brand Veggie straw or veggie sticks. We love those These crackers are a staple in our house. The girls absolutely love them. Everybody loves them um, They're perfect for like those like cheese squares they're just so good. I don't know what we're gonna do. I hope that they have them like in other places if we ever leave here <laughs> because these are like kind of important. Um, I did get some pouches for Juliet. As you'll see, we're not really big vegetable people. So um, I try to give Juliet a pouch a day just because um, I know that um, they have some veggies in them. So this is the apple blueberry green pea and this is the H-E-B baby organics and this is the banana apple carrot. Um, I ordered two packages of frozen string cheese but they substituted one for Paw Patrol which is fine. Um, we just went to see Paw Patrol live and Emma was obsessed so she'll love that. Um, I got some English muffins for breakfast, some bread, um, cloths and pickles are my favorite. My husband doesn't eat pickles, but um, Emma and I love pickles. We needed some gallon um, storage bags. I like the ones with the zipper, they're just a little bit more convenient. Um, I love this H-E-B um, orange juice. It's so, it's so good. We try, I tried it, I don't know, I think I got it for free at one point and I loved it. It was so good. So I ordered it again. We're gonna have some family in town. We usually don't buy orange juice, but if we're going to have family or visitors, I'll buy it. Um, I also got a big thing of 2% milk. Um, Juliet isn't really, I should be buying whole milk for the baby, but she really doesn't drink milk. Like she doesn't like it. Emma was kind of the same way. Um, if she asks for it, I give it to her, but, um, that's Emma. I mean, the baby doesn't really ask for it, but when I give it to her in like a sippy cup, she just like takes a sip out of it and just leaves the cup. So, um, I stopped buying whole milk because it was just going to waste. So that's kind of just for the family. We're not really big milk drinkers, but um, we do have milk with cereal and like recipes and stuff. Um, I got some sliced 
American cheese, boar's head, um, American cheese, and ham for sandwiches to go with bread. Um, some celery sticks for some recipes and snacks. Um, bananas, blueberries. We are major fruit people. Oh, you know what? I think I ordered a watermelon. I don't know where that is. Uh-oh. I better find it. Um, I hope it's not in the car. Or I hope it is in the car, actually. And they didn't forget it. Um, I got three cucumbers. I got some halos. The girls love these. Garden salad, just for some... Um, to add in a little greenery, either for lunch or for dinner. Um, I got some carrots, baby carrots, for snacks. And I got a head of iceberg lettuce. Um, gonna be trying to... <laughs> eat a little healthier so maybe I'll do some lettuce wraps for lunch um, let's see I got tortillas we're gonna do tacos one night um, I got yogurt so I got the wee strawberry yogurt it's kind of the closest thing to the Trader Joe's yogurt that I've found so far but it's still not like it you know um, but I guess I should have tried the blueberry one. I, I tried the vanilla one and I liked it, but it's not as good as Trader Joe's, but it's okay. So I like it. Um, I, I'm going to try the strawberry kind this time. I got these um, frozen yogurts for the girls. Um, Emma's been really picky about yogurt, but if anything that she sees, this is like terrible. But anything she sees that has Elsa on it, like, she'll eat it. So <laughs> I'm hoping that she'll eat that. We also got these Mickey Mouse waffles, which are the girls, one of the girls' favorites. They're so cute. Um, they're in the shape of Mickey. So we like these. The girls also love blueberry waffles, but they didn't have any. And they also like the Spider-Man waffles because they have, like, some fruit flavoring. Um, I did get some Greek yogurt for my husband. He likes to make... Um, little um yogurt with oats in it i forget what it's called overnight oats um he likes to make that so i got him that um some cream cheese some bacon for breakfast one morning and um a dozen and a half eggs this big bisquick shake and pour it's just like the easiest pancake mix um emma my kids are also well emma especially is also obsessed with this honey nut check cereal um, we did buy the, we did buy Lucky Charms last week for St. Patrick's Day, and oh my gosh, she was obsessed with them. But I'm not going to continue to buy them just because, you know, they're not really, not that checks are any good for you, but, um, I don't know. I don't want her to be eating, like, sugary cereal. Not that everything else I'm feeding her isn't just as bad, but I don't know. I don't know why I feel that way about that, but I do. Um, I tried to order her the frozen mac and cheese because we had, I had found some at Walmart. Um, they didn't have them, so they substituted them. I had ordered the Dory ones and asked them if they had the frozen ones to give me the frozen ones, but they didn't, they gave us Paw Patrol, which is just as great because she's obsessed with Paw Patrol now. So that worked out in my favor. Um, I got some Mexican rice. We're going to have tacos one night this week. Um, I got some chicken rice flavor um, to go with chicken. Um, I got mozzarella shredded cheese to go with, I'm going to make a big CD one night. And of course, this Mexican cheese for tacos. Um, let's see. Um, I also got toilet paper, the Cottonelle. I really like the Cottonelle. It is, I think there's 12. Yeah, there's 12 in there. So that's really exciting. Um, I got penne, which is for the ziti, the big ziti. Um, I also like to get this um, frozen tortellini just to have in the freezer, you know, for a lunch or for dinner. We can always, you know, have it ready at any point. So that's kind of like a backup meal just in case. Um, but actually, I think I meal planned for that this week. We're going to do the sausage with the tortellini. Um, and this sausage is going to go with the penne for the baked ZD slash baked penne. Um, and I also got ricotta cheese for the baked ZD penne. So this all kind of goes together. 
as one meal. And then um, this cheese and the ground beef is gonna go for tacos. And then this is gonna go with the tortellini, the sausage. And then we have chicken breast. And we have also, um, the chicken breast is gonna go with this chicken um, and rice. And then we also have um, pork chops. And I do already have some mac and cheese for that. And we have peppers to go with that. So I think I got to everything. I really hope that I find that watermelon. Or let me double check and see if um, I actually ordered it or if I ordered it in my head. But... Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I put out new videos. I try my best to put out new videos on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. So if you like to see the, these kind of videos, um, please subscribe to my channel and also give this video a thumbs up. Thank you. Bye. Found the watermelon safe and sound in the stroller.